These crumbling turrets that look like some forgotten city in the South American jungle are the only remains of one man's dream. Jose Paranella was a Spanish immigrant, and like Walt Disney, he had a fantasy to build a theme park. Jose decided to build his near Cairns for the enjoyment of both locals and visitors. Paranella Park was completed in 1935 and for decades was one of the top three tourist attractions in far north Queensland. Jose died in 1949, but the park remained in the family until 1977. Jose's dream to build a theme park was way ahead of its time, and his fantasy came true at least 20 years before Disneyland even opened its gates. And that brings us to this week's fantasy getaway. The Pollack family live on Queensland's Gold Coast, the home of SeaWorld, Movie World and Dream World. So we thought the girls, Kimberly and Tegan, might like to check out one of Australia's first theme parks. And the rock's pretty with the water. Paranella Park has changed since its opening in 1935, but the grand staircase gives some idea of what it was like here. The staircase was the first thing to be built in the park. It was used to bring sand from the river to make concrete for the main buildings. <laughs> there are no fancy chlorinated swimming pools here, but Mina Creek with its waterfall is lots more fun anyway. When the complex was built, Jose used the falls to generate hydroelectricity. The building survives, but the machinery has fallen victim to time and floods. It was Kimberly's idea to ride to Getaway to see if we would take the family to North Queensland. So what made you ride into Getaway? Uh, well, Mum was sick then and she kept saying, Oh, I need a holiday. <laughs> so... Then I rode in, yeah. and like a couple of days ago, we got the reply. And this is a different sort of yeah. theme yeah. park, isn't it? But it's really nice. Yeah. It's got all the... No, no.